These are some of the strategies that I'm looking at. I mentioned this yesterday in the email for the weekly reports. The after hours strategy, this is an after hours VWAP strategy. And here is the performance summary on it. It is long only since uh, the end of 2016. Obviously, the market has been pretty much a straight line up. But this is one way to capture those moves is, is in the overnight session. So um, you see here on January the 3rd, it caught, it's catching this move so far. It would have caught the move on January the 2nd. These, this is not something I'm currently trading. Um, it would have lost on the last day of, the, of 2017. It got in here. It has a very raw exit strategy, so it's possible to improve this strategy. Um, you see it lost the, the day before and the day before because we have these sell-offs in the afternoon. And so there are several days in here where it lost. You see this in the equity curve. Um, overall, this VWAP strategy is pretty good, but from about mid-December, it was down. And what a pattern that I've seen quite a bit in this market from time to time is what I'm calling the dump and run. And you see here, it goes down at the end of the day. And what the strategy does is it gets in at the close if it is down um, at the end of the day from its open in general. That's not specifically, that's not the exact rule, but in general, if it's down from its open, you buy at the close and then you sell it at the open of the next day. And so you get these moves where you're trying to catch the buy the dip and it, and it holds it underwater and then you get out if you're a day trader and then the market rallies at the end of the day. And so this is this is um, this is a strategy I developed probably midway into December, and then it really accelerated. So I developed a strategy right here, and it continued to accelerate um, through December. And so um, you see the obvious pattern right here. You, you, we were buying the market to to capture the afternoon rally. And it would not rally, and then we got out, and the market would close, and then it would rally in the after hours. And so, you see, it's a bit choppy, but it's a pattern that um, just kind of took off from uh, the end of October, and then the end, of the, end of the mid December, I synced up with it. And it um, it is a strategy that is one to take a look at. These are strategies that I'm looking at. I'm sharing this with you, so you can also watch this on your end. Um, we have. An obvious obvious runaway bull market in the stock indexes and if you're not buying and holding and you're trading it short term there are ways to capture it and then there are ways where um, if you limit yourself to a day trade sometimes you get in these scenarios um, like we've been in where um, the market goes down and you sell at the close and it rallies market goes down or it doesn't it doesn't go anywhere you buy it doesn't go anywhere um, you get out and then it rallies, and so it's 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 real. It did that quite a bit um, from mid December, almost every day towards the end of December. So it was our um, it was the more challenging trade for us is to see the lack of a afternoon rally, get out and then only to see that rally in the after hours. And so sometimes that happens, and this is a strategy that we're looking at, uh, potentially implementing the dump and run strategy as well as this overnight. VWAP strategy. The overnight VWAP strategy also uh, suffered on this afternoon, on these afternoons, uh, lack of afternoon rallies as well as you see that. But um, definitely a long only market, and it's uh, extreme. May not agree with it, the reasons for it, or the manipulation behind it. But we trade what is, and these are some potential opportunities that we're looking at and potentially going to add these to the portfolios.